Hello friends. It has been a while since I updated you on my journey. Um, it looks a little different this time because we got our new house. As I mentioned in our last video, um, we were house hunting um, and it's been super, super busy and chaotic. So that is why I haven't had the time to update like I would like to on my weight loss. But yes, we're in a new house. It has been very busy. Um, so I just wanted to go ahead and film a little update video while I had the time. So last time I believe when I filmed, I was weighing in at about 213. As of today, I am weighing in at 206.7, which in a few months time is not a huge loss. But considering how busy we've been and how much we have eaten out and I haven't really been 100% focused on just my weight loss, um, I will take that because I feel like if I wasn't on this medication, I may have gained weight or just stayed stalled. So any loss is good loss. Um, also, I am at the max dose on terzepatide. As you know, I'm taking the compounded terzepatide and it's 15 milligrams. So I am on the max dose. Um, it has always been harder for me to lose weight with PCOS. So uh, my body's tolerating the medicine great and haven't had any um, significant side effects. Um, I will say when I first upgraded to 15 milligrams, I was experiencing a bit of nausea. Um, that's to be expected. It does kind of worsen the first day after my shot and then it wears off and I just feel normal. Um, I'm still drinking my fair life protein shakes. Protein is the most important thing on this medication because you do not want muscle wasting. You want to be toned. Um, you don't want to lose your muscle and look flabby. It also helps with, uh, loose skin. Um, from what I've been told and drinking plenty of water, which I've struggled with on a daily basis. I'm doing my best with the water, but <laughs> it's a struggle. Um, and I also wanted to add in here that I am still doing the factor meals. If you want to try the factor meals, um, my dietitian did recommend them to me because they're good portion control and they're easy to track, uh, calorie wise. So if you want to try those, I will put a little coupon in my description box. I'm not sponsored by them in any way, although it does give me a little discount um, if you use my code, but it will also give you a really good uh, starting coupon. That way, if you want to try it and you don't like it, you can cancel at any time. Yeah, and last time I updated you as well, I was uh, struggling with hair loss, which has gotten better. I've added a collagen peptide um, to my regimen, which I will add in my description box if you're interested, but the collagen has helped quite a bit. Um, you hear a little like jingling it, uh, is because we have a new kitten. My daughter wanted a kitten for her birthday. And so <laughs> we have a little kitten running around. He's so cute. He's a little tuxedo cat. If he comes back, I'll, I'll have to show you um, him. But uh, she named him Beetlejuice. So we will call him Juice for short, I believe. If it was up to me, I would call him Figaro because he looks just like the cat from uh, Pinocchio. <laughs> you know who I'm talking about? Um, but yeah, he looks just like that cat, if you can imagine. Um, but anyways, yeah, so now that I'm on the 15 milligrams, I've been on that for two weeks now. I have noticed a great difference. Um, I still am eating uh, as I should, but I'm not overeating. Uh, it's definitely a good dosage for me at this time, and I think I will stay on that until I am down to 150, which is only 56 pounds away from where I'm at now. So I'm hoping by next month I can be in the 100s or Wonderland, as some of you call it. Uh, so I'm so excited for that and to share that moment with you. But um, I've been looking forward to that this whole time because it has been probably a good six years since I've seen myself in the 100s. So that's going to be a huge milestone for me. Um, also some non-scale victories. I have this really cute dress that I wore. Um, we took our four-year-old to see the Little Mermaid last night and I wore a cute black mini dress. Um, and I have, haven't been comfortable showing my legs 
uh, for a long time. And I'll throw in a picture here. I still have a long ways to go, but uh, just the confidence of losing weight and working out and just kind of looking a little bit toner, it has really made me feel better um, and a more confident in my own body. Um, I just feel better. Um, I don't have as much back pain as I did before. My headaches are, I used to get headaches every single day. I think I had a lot of like system inflammation. I don't know if that's like a normal part of PCOS, but this medication has definitely helped with my inflammation, um, my headaches, my joint pain. Uh, I know I've lost about 50, almost 50 pounds now, but it has made a world of a difference on my hip, my hip pain. Um, I was struggling with really bad hip pain for a while and uh, it's gotten better. It still flares up every now and then, but it is so much better. Um, if you guys are still thinking about doing this medication, if you've tried working out, dieting and everything and it hasn't worked for you, this medication may be the way to go for you. And I'm here to tell you there's no shame in using medication to lose weight. It is just like any other disease and some of us need it. If we have insulin resistance, if you're diabetic, if you have PCOS like me, normal methods just don't work and we need to treat it like any other disease. And yeah, so I hope to update you guys again soon. I am so sorry it has taken this long uh, <laughs> to update you, but we are still on track. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to update you uh, here in a couple weeks, hopefully, when I'm in Wonderland. If you have any questions or comments or want to share your own story, please comment, subscribe, and follow along, and we can do this together. Um, I have learned being in a community has been so much help. I've met so many people on here that are going through the same thing as me, and I love following your journeys too. It makes a world of a difference. Um, thank you for following along, and here is little Beetlejuice, or Mr. Juice as I want to call him. Isn't he adorable? Doesn't he look just like Figaro? Oh, say hello. He just wants to pay. Oh, he's purring. Say bye bye. See you next time. <laughs> bye. To end the video, I wanted to leave you with a before and after video of my face, which is super awesome. I love it.